Daniel Radcliffe might be one of the biggest actors in the world, but he's not one of the tallest, but this is why he's not ashamed of his height. Diving in, Daniel Radcliffe is one of the shortest actors in Hollywood, being 5'5", which is 4 inches shorter than the average man with an average height of 5'9". Only 3.9% of men are 5'5 or shorter, which in comparison, men over 6 feet tall make up 14% of the male population. And it's actually very common for child actors to be short, like Elijah Wood, who's 5'6", Macaulay Culkin, who's also 5'6", the Olsen twins who are only 5'2", and get towered over by their little sister, Elizabeth. And the reason child actors are so short is because studios don't want to work with really young kids, so normally hire kids a little bit older. Because of that, they look for shorter children who can pass as an 8-year-old, even if they're 10 or 12 in real life. And for Daniel Radcliffe, he said being shorter depressed him when he got older and realized he was the shortest one in the Harry Potter cast. And he eventually got confidence when he was 16, saying, I'm not tall, but I'm Harry Potter. Which it should be mentioned, Daniel Radcliffe has a net worth of $110 million. A stack of $1,000 bills is 4.3 inches. So his net worth stands at 473,000 inches, or 5,676 feet. And I'd be happy with that measurement. So with that, I'm Charles Pearl. Subscribe if you learned something.